Donna Avery here with VTTV Three Minute Leadership Nugget. Today, I want to ask you, who are you taking with you? Who are you taking with you on this journey to reach this goal? Okay, because as I look in scripture, specifically looking at the life of Paul, for example, I look at him and I see, gosh, in Corinthians, he has um, Sosthenes. He starts that out. And then in Thessalonians, he has Silvanus. I hope I'm saying that right. And Timothy. In Colossians, he has Timothy. In Romans, I believe he points out Phoebe. <laughs> He's sending Phoebe. Um, she's a lot of people's friends. Um, but I just really, I want to ask you, you know, who are you taking with you? Uh, because I think of any of the goals that I tried to reach, like back in the day, for example, with group fitness. That was the only way you were probably going to see me stay focused is if I had other people in a room that I felt like I was getting to know. And now to some degree, they were going to be like, okay, I hope to see you back next week because it was an accountability level, you know, but it was, it was fun to be on a journey with somebody else, you know, either misery loves company or, well, you know, I get to see somebody cheer me on through the goals, but either way, either way, you weren't feeling like you were doing it alone. And it might just be that one person, like Timothy, or it might be several people, like Sylvanus and Timothy in Thessalonians, and so many other areas where Paul has somebody with him, like Luke. But it's just at least having someone else that you're taking with you on the journey, because it's going to help you not only keep accountable, but it's going to make it so much more fun. And hey, we all need a witness when we hit that goal and we achieve it, right? But I just do, I think back to those times when I first got started in the gym, and if it wasn't for group fitness, I don't know what I would have done. I remember going into a group fitness my first time in San Diego, um, and that particular group fitness, I made one of my first friends that was super close to me, her name was Anisha, and we're still friends to this day as a result of finding someone in group fitness that was like, I wanna see you back here next week, and it really helped to draw me back and stay focused. Same thing for her. It really helped her to stay focused too. So as a result, the, grand, the friendship grew out of that. But I want to encourage you, just make sure that you are bringing someone with you. Comment and let me know who you bring with you as you reach this next goal. Who's in, who's in the fire with you? Because there's always somebody there and that makes it so much sweeter when you reach that goal. Love you guys.